Hi folks, I'm from HanAndroid.com where we get on Android every day. Anyway, today I'm over at my parents' house and uh, I forgot my tripod and that's why uh, my camera is just resting on a couple of uh, phones. Anyway, today's topic is Swing Copters. This is the most frustrating game in the world right now. Basically, they designed this game so you can never win at it. And most people can't get beyond a score of one on this. And some people get like score of two. They're like, yes, I'm so happy. This game sucks. It makes my life miserable. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm here to solve your problems. Let me go ahead and show you how you can enjoy the Swing Copters game the way it should have been designed. So let me show you how to do that. Let's go do this, baby. All right, to do this, I do recommend getting an older uh, device like Nexus S I got here. Um, the older, the better. You can even use like a Nexus One um, because what we're gonna do is basically underclock our phone. So to do this, uh, you'll need a couple apps. Um, you'll need a rooted Android device obviously so go ahead and root your Android phone or tablet device and then go ahead and gra grab this trickster mod app uh, it's available free on the Play Store I'll have links in the description uh, and go ahead and grab this and uh, also go ahead and grab swing copters obviously and go ahead and open swing copters before you uh, under clock so I'm gonna go ahead and open swing copters because sometimes with uh, lower uh, frequency it will not open so go ahead and open it and then go ahead hit the home button and then go ahead and go into a trickster mod app here all right and make sure uh, the setting kernel setting is not uh, checked on because you know you might get stuck uh, with a low frequency so anyway go ahead go to general here all right and what we're gonna do is set the minimum frequency um, to the minimum like on the Nexus S here, uh, you can set it all the way down to 100 megahertz. And also for maximum, also I'm gonna go ahead and set it to 100 megahertz. Now this will underclock our phone, uh, so it will run super slow. And this will help us uh, actually play the game uh, at the right speed that we want. So go ahead and hit the home button, or your recents button. And now your phone will slow down a uh, crawl, so just be very patient uh, and just wait for it. And there we go. And we're going to go ahead and switch the app to Swing Copters. And you'll be able to play the game uh, at like almost three times slower, uh, which is probably uh, makes the game a lot easier. And uh, also, this is a great way to kind of get the hang of uh, Swing Copters because they don't have a beginner's mode. Uh, this is sort of putting it into uh, easy mode. And uh, the game itself is actually still pretty hard, uh, as I can show you here, but it's a lot slower. And uh, as you can see, I'll be able to uh, play much better. So to get good at this, you need to really, oh, see, it's, it's still hard. Um, but uh, if you get practice using this method, uh, you'll be able to get better in no time. Let's do one more time here. And let me try to focus here. And here we go. Let's see what score I can get. So you really want to just kind of tap on it, keep the guy straight. And by slowing the game down, you'll be able to kind of get the hang of it. And also by doing this, I've actually gotten good uh, with the regular speed. But this obviously helps you um, take the game a lot slower. And I think the developers, when they developed this game, they were not using uh, recent Android smartphones. I think they were using like IBM 386. Uh, 25 megahertz or something because this game runs flawless uh, at slow speeds as you can see I've got to a level 5 um, just right there and I got my best score of 28 so definitely uh, if you have an Android device with a, a rooted Android device definitely try this out and uh, let me know how it goes all right to get rid of the settings you can go ahead and uh, raise your maximum frequency using trickster mod uh, or you can go ahead and simply reboot your phone um, since you didn't set it on boot uh, with a reboot your phone should be back to normal as you can see there is a way to actually enjoy the game swing copters by slowing it down you do not need to smash your phones you don't need to divorce your wife and you can now enjoy the game just the way 
the game should have been designed. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. If this video has helped you play Swing Copters better, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and as always, stay on Android.